<laughs> Raga was our first and only child. When he was born, my whole family was incredibly excited. In just a few hours after birth, we knew something was wrong with Raghav, but me and my wife didn't accept it. You know, it's our first little kid. Why do you want to say something is wrong with him? After being in the hospital for 21 days um, to find his diagnosis, we came back home empty-handed. They were unable to find the reason for all of his challenges. On his first birthday, as I was getting ready to cut the cake, I got a call from Raghav's doctor. She said, oh, we found out what is wrong with Raghav. He has this genetic condition due to a mutation in a gene called GPX4. The disease causes a lot of problems. Primarily, kids born with this condition are not able to sit, stand, walk, talk. And in fact, in some severe cases, kids with this condition have passed away a few weeks or a few months after birth. She said that Raghav was the only kid they knew of with this disease. And there was nothing that they could do besides advising us to go back home and love Raghav more than we ever did. That gave me this problem that I really, really wanted to fix for my dear son. As a software engineer by training, I was exposed to problem solving every day, and I've been creating these algorithms for, for everything in my life. And so when I got Raghav's diagnosis, my mind went into the problem solving mode. I identified 36 drugs that I could potentially reuse for his condition. A couple of days after we got Raghav started on one of these drugs, he showed a significant improvement to his energy levels to a point where he was able to lift his head up for the very first time that he had never done in 15 months of his life. <laughs> uh, we are now in the process of evaluating a sixth drug that we can potentially try with this condition. We've also started working on a gene therapy treatment for this condition as a more longer term treatment for his problem. I started in this journey just to inform and help this doctor make, make a clever decision and get a, get a treatment for my son. And as I walked through this journey, I realized it's just not only my, do my doctor, it's the entire biotech ecosystem that cannot find a treatment for my son. Because one, his disease is too new. The industry is not set up to find treatments for such small number of patients. And so I started putting together a team of people that could help r build Raghav's gene therapy and I realized that a lot of other patients are attempting to do the same. But unfortunately, they, they don't have the team and they don't have uh, the tools necessary for them to advance their programs forward. I realized that open source is actually a great tool to, to solve the kind of challenging drug development problems that we are facing with my son. And so I started a, a nonprofit organization called Open Treatments Foundation. We are hoping to bring gene therapy treatments and other types of treatments to all the patients suffering with rare diseases. It is incredibly important for patients to be empowered to find a treatment for their conditions and for their loved ones and for their entire community because that is how we would, we would get to treatments for all of the 7,000 to 10,000 rare diseases. While we can wait for the biotech companies to, to catch up and help build treatments for all of these, I think we need to work together as a community to help the companies get to treatments for all of us. And that is the reason why I went down this path of decentralizing drug development, starting with patients and empowering them to build a treatment for their conditions. This journey can feel devastating, lonely, and painful, but it is not hopeless. There is hope, there is light at the end of the tunnel. Every parent going through this journey will have to understand that there is a possibility that you have in your hand that you can do something about it for your kid and for other kids affected with this condition. I am Sanat Kumar Ramesh. I am the father of a two-year-old boy, Raghav, and the CEO of Open Treatments Foundation. And I am Bio. <laughs>